This video is going to show you how to add a syllabus or other basic file into D2L 10.3. To do this, you first of all need to start within the course where you want to add the file, and then you need to go to the content area, which can be found in two ways. One, you can either choose content from this course materials menu, or two, if you have a content browser widget, then you can just click here on the create some content link. If this is your first time adding content to this course, your screen will look like this. You'll be on the overview page. Now, I would recommend clicking first on the table of contents link, as this table of contents is the view your students are going to see when they first enter the content area. From this table of contents, you'll first need to add a module or folder where your syllabus documents can be placed. You can add a module by clicking in either of these two add a module boxes, giving your module a title, and then clicking enter or the return key. This will create a module where you can then place your document. Now if you're using Chrome, Safari, or Firefox, all you'll need to do to add a document into this module is simply drag it from your computer, either your desktop or another folder. You can drag the file right into the module. If you happen to be using Internet Explorer and can't do the drag and drop, you can have the same effect by selecting Upload Files from the new menu clicking Upload, and then selecting the file that you want to upload from the menu and clicking Open. Then clicking Add. This is another way that you can add a basic file into your course. Either drag it in from your computer or select Upload Files from the new menu within your module.